Let's simplify the complex fraction x over 2 plus 2 plus 2 over x, all of that all over x over 2 plus 1. And let's use method 1 to simplify this complex fraction. Now, step 1 is to write both the numerator and denominator as single fractions. And to do this, they need to have common denominators. Now looking at the numerator, the common denominator of the numerator terms is 2x. So for the first term, we'd have to multiply top and bottom by x. So we'd have x squared over 2x. For the second term, we'd have to multiply top and bottom by 2x. So we'd have plus 4x all over 2x. And for the third term, we'd have to multiply top and bottom by 2. So we'd have plus 4 over 2x. And now looking at the denominator terms, the common denominator would be 2. Now the first term is already over 2, so we'd leave that alone. Multiplying top and bottom of 1 by 2, we get 2 over 2. So combining these so that we have one fraction on top and one fraction on bottom, we'd have x squared plus 4x plus 4 all over 2x. All of that all over x plus 2 over 2. Now step two is to multiply the numerator fraction by the reciprocal of the denominator fraction. So that's taking the x squared plus 4x plus 4 all over 2x and we multiply that by the, the reciprocal of the denominator fraction which would be 2 over x plus 2. Again, the reason why we do this is recalling all the way back to when we first learned about fractions, that dividing by a fraction is the same thing as multiplying by its reciprocal. Now step three is simplifying all of this. Now remember, when you're multiplying rational expressions, that you first factor your numerators and denominators. So the numerator of the first one factors to x plus 2 times x plus 2. The denominator stays 2x. The uh, second term cannot be factored, so we leave that alone, so it'll be 2 over x plus 2. The next step is to cancel any common factors. So one of the x plus 2's cancel, the 2's cancel, so we end up with x plus 2 all over x. And this is our final answer. Again, noting that the final answer is a single fraction with no fractions in the numerator and no fractions in the denominator.